In this video, I will go over what peak solar hours are and how to use them to determine how much energy your panels can produce. The first thing to understand about peak solar hours is that this value is an average. Solar panels are rated at a certain radiation level of 1000 watts per meter squared. The sun isn't always producing this high of radiation, especially in the morning hours, which means whatever wattage panel you have will not always be producing that amount of watts at a given time. Rather than having to go through complicated analysis for every region, the government has already simplified it for us. Pulling up this chart from NREL, which I also include in the description, shows us the average peak solar hours of your location. This takes the low radiation levels of the morning and the high at the noon and averages it out to one number that you can then multiply by your panel wattage to determine your total energy production for that day. Looking at this Excel table here, we can enter an 100 watt solar panel and the peak solar hours of 5.5, which I've chosen because I am in California. The total energy produced here is 550 watt hours, which I get by multiplying the watts times the hours. And as you know, watt hours is a figure of energy. And that is an example of what peak solar hours are and how that figure can be used to determine your energy production. Keep in mind that this does not account for any efficiency losses that may occur due to other factors, which I'll explain into my other videos. Thank you.